What it do, what it do, what it do. It's your boy, Silla Cell, and we back in here with another episode of Juice City Legends. If you have not, please hit the like button. Please subscribe. Hey, before we get started, man, I want to give a shout out to the game, man. Shout out to all the supporters, all my subscribers. We 18 subscribers away from 1K. 18 subscribers away, man. Y'all keep subscribing, y'all keep sharing, y'all keep liking. Let's get it. All right, gang. Today we're going to be talking about popular YouTuber Tasha K and her lawsuit against Cardi B. <clears throat> okay, so those for those of you who don't know what's going on, Tasha K is a YouTuber. She has a huge ha platform. Uh, basically, she got like a Wendy Williams type of show. You know what I'm saying? She uh, she know, She's known to go on her show and drink wine with all her subscribers, and she called her subscribers or winos or whatever so she like drunk talking gossiping basically you know what i'm saying so i don't know if it was a year ago maybe two years ago but she had came out with some rumors about cardi b allegedly this is allegedly having herpes or whatever and for whatever reason she had a big problem with cardi b man you know what i'm saying when i first saw tasha k's platform this was before the situation with her and cardi b Every time I would get on her platform, she would just gossip and gossip and gossip and drag people's names in the mud. And uh, I know I'm a blogger too. And I know that we get likes and views off of drama. You know what I'm saying? I can tell you that because I can make a video about something positive and it might do 10 views. I make a video about some drama, some beef or something like that. It's going 10K in one day. You know what I'm saying? So I understand that drama and negativity brings views to your channel but at the same time you had to understand when you're talking about these people you're talking about people's lives or whatever when you're talking about cardi b yes yeah, she's the one in public but what about her family members what about her sisters what about her her children you know what i'm saying how, how do you think that's going to affect her brand her um getting contracts and things like that when you out here spreading nonsense about a person that you don't even know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know any of these rappers that I make blogs about. But the thing about me, I'm going to report on what's out there. I'm never going to go out here and make up something, make up a lie to try to get somebody to like my pro, my, my platform. If you, if, you don't, if you don't like what I'm talking about, if you think I'm going to make videos gossiping and lying, making up stuff, to get you to watch my channel is just not gonna happen. And Tasha K, I think she's talented. You know what I'm saying? She has something. She has a lot of subscribers. She has a talent. She could uh, she she. They, it's a space for her on YouTube. And you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna dog her out about the gossip thing because that's what that's what they do on the internet. But when you making up lies and stuff like that, it's hurting people's family. You know what I'm saying? You're wrong for that. And now uh. They went to court or whatever, and of course she lost a $1.3 million lawsuit. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm not going to count her money and say that she has it or not, but it's a waste of time. So my advice to Tasha K, man, is just stop all the foolishness, man. Stop making up rumors gossiping about people, man. You know what I'm saying? Report what's out there if you're going to do that because TMZ and all these tabloid people, they get paid on doing that, but at the same time, you have to be careful with what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to like Cardi B music. You know what I'm saying? I don't really care for a lot of her music, but she's, you know what I'm saying, somebody in the culture. Um, she's doing her thing. She's feeding her family. You know what I'm saying? She's providing for her people. And that's all, you know what I'm saying? That's all that should matter. Tasha K, you're a beautiful woman. You know what I'm saying? You seem like you're very intelligent and smart. So just, just don't do that. You know what I'm saying? If a car to be, you know what I'm saying, you did what you're supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? You can't you can't allow the disrespect to get that out of hand because the thing about rumors or whatever, if you can if you let allow a rumor to keep going on and going on, it's gonna come to truth in some people's eyes. And I've heard grown men tell me stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Hey man, they say Carter B this. I'm like, bruh, you will never get close to Carter B, man. Why does it matter what somebody says she smells like and all that, man? I just can't believe some of the ridiculous things that come out of people's mouths, man. You know what I'm saying? And like I say, me being a blogger, I'm never going to let this blogging affect my real life. You know what I'm saying? Because what bloggers have to understand, all it takes 
is for the person that you're doing the blog about to get in contact with somebody in your city, one of your ops, somebody who didn't like you from back in the day in school, and they will touch you. You can be touched. You know what I'm saying? Your children can be affected from this. Your job can be affected by this, man. So y'all just cut all that out, man. Don't be on the internet lying, making up rumors and stuff like that. I hate that. And you know what I'm saying? Because I was just looking at the internet the other day, and uh, Memphis rapper Key Glock, he was, he was mad about all that, all that, all these lies and rumors that bloggers make up. Man, y'all got to cut all that out, man. You know what I'm saying? Get more productive. Be more creative. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to just make videos about other people's lives, especially if you going on there to be negative and try to bring somebody down. Because what they're really saying, you're not happy with yourself. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to Tasha K, man. You know what I'm saying? I hope you learned your lesson, man, because what you were doing on the internet, that's just wrong, man. And I have wrote on you in your comments before, man. You need to cut all of that out, man. You know what I'm saying? Carter B, you keep doing your thing, man. You know what I'm saying? All the bloggers, man, I hope y'all learned a lesson, man. And hey, y'all get down in them comments and let me know what y'all think. This your boy, Sally Sale, Juice City Legends. We checking out. Peace.